How's it going guys, it's Josh here, welcome back to another video. So a little while ago, Grand Vela sent me a couple of their 10 keyless mechanical Eagle Z77 keyboards. They both look exactly the same when you get them out of the box, only one is cheaper and one is more expensive. Now if you're not particularly familiar with mechanical keyboards, there's basically three variants in terms of lighting. There's the ones with no lighting, then we have multicolour backlighting, which is sometimes referred to as rainbow lighting, and finally there's RGB backlighting. We'll leave out the ones with no backlighting because that's pretty self-explanatory, so that just leaves us with multicolour and RGB. What's the difference? Well, a multicolour backlit keyboard will normally have some effects built in, so you can have cool animated effects like this. There's even some that are responsive to key presses. Whichever effect that you select though, you'll notice that each row is always the same colour. In this case, it's pink, purple, blue, green, orange, red. Now unfortunately, there is no way to change this. Each row is locked to that colour, so you're stuck with something that you can't really customise to match your setup. That explains the cheaper price, and these keyboards are known as multicolour or rainbow backlit keyboards. So look out for those words if this isn't quite what you're after. So now, fully RGB keyboards. Now the difference here is that every key has its own RGB LED beneath it which is totally customisable on the keyboard or from a separate piece of software if that's included. Now this pretty much opens up unlimited possibilities in terms of lighting profiles and effects, perhaps my favourite are the gradient rainbow effects. However if you want to individually customise each key, you can do that as well. As you can see, it's very versatile and it's only really limited by the effect presets stored on the keyboard itself or the presets within the software if it uses that. I will do a separate video on keyboards with stored lighting presets versus keyboards with software controlled lighting, but today I just wanted to briefly show the differences between multicolour backlighting and RGB backlighting. Finally then, which is better? Well, it really depends on your budget, but to be honest, RGB keyboards are not that much more expensive and in my opinion, it's totally worth the extra cost. You'll get a lot more customizability, and you should be more happy with it in the long run. Of course, that's not to say that multicolour keyboards don't have a place in the market. If you are on a very tight budget and you just want something that lights up, then they do the job just fine. If you do decide to go for an RGB keyboard, just always double check that it is an RGB keyboard that you're buying and not a rainbow multicolour one. If you want to check out either of the keyboards featured in this video, I'll drop the Amazon links in the description down below. I will soon be doing a full review on these keyboards too. I hope you all enjoyed the video today guys. Thanks for watching, subscribe for more and I'll catch you all in the next one.